using a calculator to find unknown angles. We have an example here of a right triangle. We are missing this angle here. This side is opposite the angle. I'm going to label it opposite. This side is adjacent to the angle. I'm going to label it adjacent. I have a ratio that I have memorized that the tangent of an angle is equal to the opposite side over the adjacent side. So if I use this ratio, I can set up the tangent of x equals 4.625 divided by 6.625. Now I can go to my calculator and enter this division problem. Making sure it's cleared first, 4.625 divided by 6.5625 equals, and I get this answer of 0.70476, etc. That does not give me my answer for x. That gives me my answer for the tangent of x, 761904. Oh, All right, that's the tangent of x. We want to know what angle gives us that answer. When does tangent equal this? So we have to use the second tangent. That tangent above there with the little negative 1 in the upper right hand corner is read as arc tangent. And we're going to hit second for the arc tangent and get x equals 35.1747.2296. That's degrees. But that's a very long decimal degree. And we already know how to switch that to degrees, minutes, seconds. We come back to our calculator, hit second, degrees, minutes, seconds. And we get 35 degrees, 10 minutes, 29 seconds. So you need to remember when you enter this into your calculator, once you divide, you don't have your answer. You need to use your second or your inverse button and then your trig function to get the decimal degree and then your DMS button to change it back into degrees, minutes, and seconds. Please pause the video now and complete the problems in your workbook. When finished, press play and we'll continue with the next lesson.